an iconic 90s music video moment is resurfacing, and the reason why is heartbreaking. Here's what Michelle Pfeiffer has to say about the loss of a rap legend. On September 28, 1990s rap icon Coolio died at 59. The shocking news broke after his talent manager shared a statement with TMZ, which read, We are saddened by the loss of our dear friend and client Coolio, who passed away Wednesday afternoon. He touched the world with the gift of his talent and will be missed profoundly. Please have Coolio's loved ones in your thoughts and prayers. As of the making of this video, the cause of his death has yet to be revealed. On the day of his death, paramedics were called to his friend's house in Los Angeles for an emergency, where Coolio was then pronounced dead at the scene. According to TMZ, only days before, Coolio shared an Instagram video of him performing for a live crowd, appearing fit and healthy. Coolio, born Artis Leon Ivy Jr., found mainstream success in 1995 with his signature hit, Gangsta's Paradise, which earned him a Best Rap Solo Performance Grammy. The track was also the biggest selling single of 1995 and was voted the best single of the year in The Village Voice. The song was featured on the soundtrack to the film Dangerous Minds, which was based on the autobiography My Posse Don't Do Homework, written by a retired Marine-turned teacher. The film star, Michelle Pfeiffer, also appeared in the music video for Gangsta's Paradise. Pfeiffer was among the many who shared their sadness on social media in the wake of Coolio's death. The actor uploaded a clip on Instagram of the music video and attached a photo of the pair looking happy to be in each other's company. In her caption, Pfeiffer shared a touching tribute which read, Heartbroken to hear of the passing of the gifted artist, Coolio. A life cut entirely too short. As some of you may know, I was lucky enough to work with him on Dangerous Minds in 1995. He won a Grammy for his brilliant song on the soundtrack, which I think was the reason our film saw so much success. I love that song. Pfeiffer recalled that the rapper was nothing but gracious, then ended her post. 30 years later, I still get chills when I hear the song sending love and light to his family. Rest in power. This isn't the first time Pfeiffer has spoken about Coolio in recent years. During a 2021 appearance on Jimmy Kimmel Live, she discussed Gangsta's Paradise and expressed her love for the song. Pfeiffer admitted that she had never heard of him before doing the video. When asked whether the pair stayed in touch, she admitted they had not. Fans took to the comments section of her Instagram post to express their emotions. One user wrote, First thing that crossed my mind, iconic video and work. Sentimental tribute, Michelle. Another person shared, One of the greatest hip-hop tracks and videos of all time. Incredibly sad day. R.I.P. Coolio. A third fan remarked, I listen to the song every single day, literally. So sad. Pfeiffer isn't the only high-profile star who paid tribute after Coolio's death on social media. Weird Al Yankovic, who parodied Gangsta's Paradise with his song, Amish Paradise, shared a wholesome snapshot on Twitter of the two smiling and hugging, simply writing, R.I.P. Coolio. Fellow rap icon Ice Cube recalled following Coolio's journey, tweeting, This is sad news. I witnessed firsthand this man's grind to the top of the industry. Rest in peace, Coolio. LL Cool J also shared his respects, posting, Rest in power, my brother. Love and respect. Coolio released his last studio album, From the Bottom to the Top, in 2009. He became a fairly regular face on television, appearing on Ultimate Big Brother in the UK in 2010, after previously competing on Celebrity Big Brother a year prior. He also appeared on Celebrity Wife Swap and lent his voice to animated shows, including Duckman and Gravity Falls.